Hi, I'm Troy Austin with Team Halliburton Highlands. And I'm Amanda Tancredi with Team Halliburton Highlands. And where are we today, Amanda? We are at this amazing passive house in Minden. Uh, we're minutes from the hospital, all the amenities that you need. Yes, and this is our first passive home, so we're going to find out what that is today. Angie from Quantum Passive House is here, and she's going to educate us a little bit on what a passive house is, because we don't know. It's our first one. Yeah, we have no idea. We're super excited to get all the intel on it, and uh, can't wait to chat with her. I'm sitting here with Angie today, and we're talking about her spectacular passive home. Angie, what is a passive home? Well, passive house can be described in many different ways. There's the technical version of what makes a passive house, how do you do it, and then there's the experience of a passive house. If I'm to sum it up in the quickest way possible, it would be that it's a crazy energy efficient house. It's approximately 75 to 90 percent more efficient than a standard pack than a standard building. As well, it's known for being exceptionally comfortable and a healthy home in terms of air quality and any other measures you can think of. Wow. Awesome. It's healthier, it's cheaper, and it's also more comfortable. More comfortable. Yes. Um, and I just have to say, it's one of the most comfortable homes I've ever lived in, and I've been really proud to be building this with other folks. Yeah. Some people want to sell passive house because it's more affordable to live in, but then people who have money to spend, their interest is not necessarily that, but their interest is comfort. So it is actually known as to be the most energy efficient standard in the world, as well as the most comfortable. One of the reasons why it is known to be so healthy is because contrary to other buildings, like a standard uh, build in North America, the ventilation in this house is 24 seven. So most standard buildings have a ERV or a HRV that has to go into defrost mode. So it's recycling the same stale air but in a passive house, such as this one, it's 24 seven fresh air. So you never recirculate stale air. And in particular, at times of COVID, this is a good benefit. Thanks for sharing all this wonderful information, Angie. So where do you go to, to have this built? Where would you go? Well, there are multiple people that build passive houses. We also design and build at Quantum Passive House right here in Minden, and we supply to all of them. So, so you so we, the manufactured right here in the village of Minden in Halbert County, and you service all of Ontario. That's right. And I should mention that we, one of our key focuses is that we produce prefabricated panels. So they're panels that are insulated, airtight, weathertight, and so they get shipped to site and put up with cranes quite rapidly. Like a very large house in a matter of two days, and one house, a small single family house like this one in a matter of hours. Well, Amanda, wow. you know where we're going to next. Yeah, I know. We're going to go check it out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's nice. Thank you. Wow, I had no idea there was so much to a passive house. Yeah, my, that was so educational. Uh, you know, not only, I, you know, I figured you'd save so much money with it, but I didn't realize even all the health benefits involved with it. So, um, yeah, it's pretty incredible. Yeah, for sure. Well, to highlight what this house is, right before we go, it's uh, right in the village of Minden, a beautiful neighborhood. The house itself is just pride of ownership. It just so, shows so well. Uh, 1,650 square feet, three bedrooms, high vaulted ceilings. I love the den with the two piece. Yeah, it could double as an office for those working from home. It's just phenomenally done. The kitchen's beautiful. Everything's just been done to perfection. For any more information on this property or any of our other properties, please visit teamhalliburtonhighlands.com.